And truly one game at a time now for Steve Shirley and his team. They'll try to creep a little closer to St. Paul. And four to nothing is the final here in this one. Third inning was where Sioux Falls got all four runs. Mark Shorey, a single. Gus Milner was on second base. That said play pin praise through to first. Milner scored, and then Brandon Singh followed that up, ripped that double down the left field line. Shorey in to make it two to nothing. Francisco Leandro followed up with a triple. Scored Brandon Singh from third. And they were not done yet as Hunter Jones with a single to drive in Francisco Leandro. And that was it. Four runs off of labor in that third inning. Ben Moore on the other side, just three hits given up because he gets the shutout. And he is standing by down on the field with Aliar. Player of the game, Ben Moore for Midco Sports. You know, you had a three hitter today. The end, the list is endless for your accolades and your awards. Straight up, why are you so good? Um, well, I mean, we, I got a good defense behind me, to be honest with you. And, you know, I, you know I've been working real hard on my off-speed stuff. And, you know, everything just kind of clicked this year. Um, you know, tonight you were able to put produce a three hitter. What contributed to that success here in today's game? Um, I think uh, it was the fact that I had played these guys a couple times before and they hit me around pretty good. Um, so I, I kind of changed my game plan and I, I kind of hope that they didn't change theirs until later in the game, which they ended up doing. How does it feel to be acknowledged with all of your awards and accolades and what you're able to do out on the field and having that acknowledgement? Uh, it's a little weird, it's a little unexpected. Um, but, you know, last year, I, I had a good year last year, and, you know, I was just hoping to build on it. I didn't expect to have this kind of year, you know, that I'm having so far. But, uh, you know, it's pretty cool. I'm not going to lie to you. This is your fifth series of you guys meeting Fargo-Moorhead uh, this season, and this is your first sweep. Does it feel good to do it on the road? Yeah, it feels great. I mean, um, we, we've been up and down. We've been struggling. It, it's really, you know, special for us to put, a, put together a three-game winning streak, especially against these guys because, I mean, I, like they announced it, they're the five-time, you know, defending champions. And, I mean, they're, they're a good team, and Doug puts, puts together a great team, so it's a battle every time. Ben, thank you so much, and congrats on your big sweep. Thanks, Alex. Thanks. Back to you guys. All right, thank you, Allie. And, yeah, congrats. Ben Moore, 12th win of the year as he continues to roll on. Doesn't get the sweep, and they will head up to Winnipeg for the next four. Argo Moorhead will take their show on the road as well. They head to Lincoln later on this afternoon and then get back here to host St. Paul next weekend. Jack Michaels. Dallas. Thank you, man. I'm going to go get some food. Please go now. <laughs> it was a treat, my friend. Glad to be part of it. For Ali Arlt, everybody in the truck, thank you, guys. For Jack Michaels, Tom Neiman, good afternoon from... Margo Moorhead, thanks for watching on Midco Sports Network.